and Brazil and New Zealand have been closing the gap. Not quite the international flavor we would normally have here in Seged. As we look at the C2 women's 500 meter final A, still plenty from across the world have made their way here as best they can. Well, the winners a year ago in Seged in the World Championships, the Chinese pair Sun Mengia Chu Shi Zhao are not in attendance, along with either a silver or a bronze medalist. Chance for maybe some home success. Laura Gonzal and Opavski. Teenagers in the Hungarian boat. The real eyes will be on the Ukrainians. Neodymyl Ya Luzan winning the C1 500 meter final yesterday and just pipped to what would have been double gold for the Ukrainian by American teen sensation Nevin Harrison. She's alongside Anastasia Shetverkova. Certainly there'll be revenge on the mind of the Spanish boat. Corbera having finished third in that C1 500 meter final that Luzan won. We're underway. The women's C2 500 meter final. That's an early lead for the Ukrainians. Luzan and Chet Verikova powering away. It's the Spanish duo of uh, Antia Jacome, their namesake, Anita Otero, trying to keep on their tail, but it's Luzan out front, driving the Ukrainian duo and absolutely dominating all the way to the finish. More than a boat length clear. The Spaniards trying to fight back. There's a push from the Moldovans to try and get on the podium. Daniela Kokiu and Maria Olarosu. But it's clear daylight in the city of sunshine. And Luzan, with immaculate focus, driving her way to what would be a second gold of the weekend here in Hungary. Superb consistency of stroke throughout and leaving the rest of the field in their wake. So there's a battle on for the podium. The Dolvin boat trying to snatch it on the line. And they have managed to come in second. And maybe Spain just nicking third, but it's gold for Ukraine. Pre race favourites. Making sure there were no mistakes. Uh, Chet Verikova, the back of the pairing. Herself won a bronze in the C1 500 last year at the World Championships here. Luzan and Chet Verikova. Absolutely dominant. Well, the Chileans of Karen Rocco and Maria Ayara had looked to be in pole position for second, but seemed to just lose any momentum. Moldovans taking silver and then right on the line the Chileans have just 
look to have snatched bronze. But it's Luzan and Chet Merikova who are all smiles in the Ukrainian boat. Merikova with a terrific silver coming from behind late. So domination from Ukraine plus 2.38 seconds. Moldova taking the silver just by 0 0.06. Chile just held off the boat of Spain.